Hi, this will be a little review on my AFID X450 quad, a 40, what is it, $6 frame, $48 frame. I uh, really impressed with this build. Uh, built it with uh, the DJI E300 system. Uh, oh, and uh, my hat's off to uh, the Flying Rookie for uh, his build on this. Um, I went a little bit different here. I'm uh, running my vector flight controller, which uh, kind of was a disaster on my uh, 6S powered uh, flip FPV quad. Uh, initially I was running here the uh, stock props, the 9443 and 3S power. I uh, got the Mobius hard mounted here. And uh, I think uh, it was running fairly smooth. You could see some jello there, especially when you get into the brighter light. This here is at sunset. But uh, overall, very uh, nice system. I'm running uh, R-Link UHF system and a 400 milliwatt uh, Boscam 5.8 gigahertz uh, video transmitter. And I've been running that transmitter on quite a few quads. I like it. There's a lot of new stuff out and uh, eventually try some 1.3, but this has been pretty bulletproof for me. Um, here, even though it looks like the quad's moving pretty good, I thought it was uh, pretty underpowered with uh, 3S and the 9443. Um, especially if you're kind of in a free fall or did a flip Oh, deer coming up here somewhere. Anyways, the um, it has a hard time just regaining control. I didn't think uh, there's the deer had enough uh, control, and uh, I went and did try the 9550 props. Found them to be stiffer, and I thought 3S was uh, working pretty adequate with that setup. And uh, I did try 4S. I thought 4S, uh, you, know, you notice it right away in the throttle response. But even with 3S, the 9450 props uh, was pretty good setup. I, I'm not even sure if, I, I think I might stick with 3S and the 9450 just for um, being a little bit lighter. And uh, if it's performing well enough, then I'll just stick with it. Um, here, with more light, you could see more jello with the Mobius is recording in uh, 720p. It's the standard lens set in wide mode at 30 frames per second. So it's gonna you're gonna get some jello. And I did this is the stock camera, which uh, is horrible. Uh, everything's pink. Um, I did go ahead and replace it with a uh, PZ0420 run cam and uh, there's that much better the colors are uh, much more correct and uh, much crisper picture I, I'm running these on all my quads the same camera um, except for my mini I've got another one I'm trying out on that I did try also on this quad some of the multi-star low C rated batteries, those 10 C batteries and 3S power and had a couple failures with them uh, as they got closer towards the end of their lifespan kind of approaching 3.7 volts, uh, 3.5 volts I know usually I land at 3.5 but I don't expect it to drop out of the sky and that's that's what happened. Uh, happened twice, um, but not every time. So I'm not quite sure. Not real happy with them. These shots, the last one and this one, are running with uh, vibration dampening uh, plates that I got from High Model. I think it does a pretty good job. Here you could see a little shakiness, and I think that's just due to the balls being they're the softer kind. Uh, 
I think if I switch them out, it'll be even more imp improved. A few horses there. Here, I'm just showing the how it flies in a strong wind. Uh, the winds here are, are they were kind of changing, but uh, gusting. But I, I think it's been really windy the last few days. I think this is pushing 20 mile an hour, so it's pretty tough. This uh, little quad's not all that fast to begin with, and then uh, pushing it against the wind, you could see where I got shoved back there, even with the quad oriented the way it is. But it's still uh, still making its way through the wind and uh, better than you know maybe you'd expect on a lightweight quad here. I'm running fairly smaller batteries. Uh, uh, I think in this video is a little bit larger 3S. Maybe I'm running one of the multi stars here. Those are the only larger 3S batteries that I've tried on here, but it's flown good with whatever weight I've thrown on it. And with the vector on this, this is 4S, I mean, it's fairly controllable. I mean, I land on my back, my truck here with pretty good control. That's the mount. And thanks, everybody, for watching.